But first, a deadly shooting that rattled downtown Greensboro just before lunchtime. This is insane to, to have a shooting in, in broad daylight like this in the middle of downtown. Uh, heavily populated area, people going to court, uh, people going to work, people just trying to live. Police Ch Chief Brian James says three people were shot downtown just before noon and one has since died. Cars and buildings were caught in the crossfire and now police are looking for multiple suspects. Tonight we've learned a police officer with a private company was also involved. WFMY News 2's Jess Winters is live downtown with an update. Jess. A shootout in busy downtown Greensboro this morning leaves one person dead and Greensboro police say whoever caused the mayhem in broad daylight is still on the loose tonight. GPD says that three men were shot overall. 20 year old Avion Amin McLean died at the hospital. Another is still fighting for his life in critical condition and the third has non life threatening injuries. The violence erupted around 1130 this morning in front of the Guilford County Sheriff's Office on Eugene Street. GPD says multiple shooters opened fire and quote many shots rang out. Bullets hit the sheriff's office doors, leaving shattered glass, but no one was hurt inside. The three men were shot right outside. I asked Chief James if this was random or a targeted attack. It's hard to say at this point. Uh, uh, I would say that preliminarily, I would say it looks like it was targeted, uh, but we are following up on information to confirm that. Uh, but, but it certainly would be unusual uh, for a random act like this to occur in, in broad daylight. A company police officer witnessed the shooting in front of the sheriff's office and jumped into action. GPD says that security officer fired at the suspects, but that's all we know at this time. Now, police are looking for witnesses to come forward, and they're also reviewing surveillance footage. They say when they have some clear images, they'll release suspect information and the car vehicle description. As far as downtown Greensboro, looking more like the Wild West this morning as people were walking about, people were driving their cars. Chief James says, it's completely insane and concerning.